They have not lost a single game so far in 2014. Tonight, the Santa Barbara boys basketball team opening up the CIF Division 3A playoffs as the top seed. Star Jack Baker and the Dons look to extinguish fireball of Linwood. Early on, David Trujillo with a terrific tip in. Dons love to push it. Baker glides in for two. Seconds later, Don's getting the turnover. Isaiah Tapia strolls in just three minutes into the game. It's 18 to 5, Santa Barbara. On the break, Noah Burke to Tapia, step back jumper. He had 19 points. Baker leading the way with 23 points, 11 rebounds. Santa Barbara rolls 92 38. They're 23 and 2 of the year. They've won 12 straight. The Don's play Friday at home in a second round game against Shadow Hills. At San Marcos High School, Dave O'Dell's Royals trying for a bit of redemption after a disappointing third place finish in the Channel League. San Marcos opening the Division 3A playoffs against South Pasadena. Bryce Ridnauer's block starting the break. The Royals stay with it. Nice passing and Christian Widmer scores it plus the foul. San Marcos up 40 to 28 late in the third. Elijah Johnson. He led San Marcos with 26 points. Royals feeling good heading into the fourth quarter. Johnson to Scott Everman, he had 12 points, and as did Bryce Ridnauer. This play by Bryce, it's nice. Royals have the right moves tonight. They win 62-52. Next up, a date at Florida State bound Robbie Berwick and a Tascadero. Carpinteria basketball won their first league title since 1999 after sharing the Frontier's top spot with Nordoff. But the CIF handed the Home Warriors a tough first-round Division 4A game, the St. Joseph Knights of Santa Maria. St. Joe's Aaron Olson, a three-pointer. Knights up double digits in the second quarter. Carp makes a run. Duncan Gordon pops a jumper. He had 16 points. Warriors get a turnover. Mason Pacerni goes in for the lay-in. Carp within seven, but the Knights have several players back from last year's team that went to the state tournament, like Keith Datu. He scores the jump hook. St. Joe's wins 53-32. Carp ends a fine season at 18-8. Knights will play top seed Village Christian on Friday. Division 5 AA Bishop Diego smashes Santa Rosa Academy. Santa Clara takes out Temecula Prep. Division 3A Lompoc wins. 4 AA Nordoff losing to Paraclete. Division 4A St. Bonaventure wins at San Ynez. Laguna Blanca wins their Division 6 contest. Santa Barbara High School girls basketball barely broke a sweat tonight in their first round game. The Dons enter the postseason as a top ranked team in Division 3 AA. Like the boys, Fireball never had a chance. The Falcons trying to go behind the back on the dribble. Jocelyn Pettitat not having any of that. The steal and the layup. 9-0 Dons. It would get much, much worse. Nice passing. Michaela Miller makes it 17-0. Senior Alyssa Cosio, the baseline J. The Dons led 45-0 at one point in this game. Mercifully, they used a running clock to finish this one up. Santa Barbara wins 64-11. Well, the San Marcos girls water polo team is looking to make a splash in the Division I playoffs after their best season ever. The Royals earned their first league title ever as they shared the crown with the rival Santa Barbara. San Marcos home today against Villa Park. Round one action. Paige Hauschild scores for the Royals. San Marcos fast break. Haley Johnson the long pass to Hauschild. She swims in and scores. San Marcos wins 17 to 8. Royals advance to Saturday's quarterfinals on the road against Los Alamitos. Back to Santa Barbara High School. Don's water polo starting fast against Saddleback. Opening moments, penalty shot, and Jesse Ranson scores. That's the game's first goal. Santa Barbara on the move again. Mackenzie Fell to Kai McGoy. She makes it 2 0 Don's and still in the first quarter. Lauren Dugan. From way outside, she finds the back of the net. Santa Barbara wins 8-1. Don's advance to Saturday's quarterfinals at Corona Del Mar. Nationally, number one, Syracuse College men's basketball losing in overtime to Boston College. And Dwight Howard booed every time he touched the ball at Staples Center in his return against the Lakers. But, you know, the Lakers lost like they do <laughs> every night. Houston won by 26 points. Oh. Yeah. Tough Thanks. one. Thanks, Thank you, Mike. Mike.